We're here, we are back at LM Engines with Hulk. That's right. We are going to do a dyno run, a baseline run of how Hulk is before Hulk gets what? Cams. That's right. This is going to be the first cammed 2020 Shelby GT500. you all longer spirits we are here we are back at LM engines with Hulk that's right we are going to do a dyno run a baseline run of how Hulk is before Hulk gets what cams that's right this is going to be the first cammed 2020 Shelby GT500 in the world is going to be Hulk I told you the mods are coming it's happening now we'll start with the dyno baseline and we'll start going from there. I'm so excited. Let's see what happens. As a rundown, yes, Hulk has been stock for a while. Uh, we're gonna do, I, as you guys saw last video, we were at LM Engines. Now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna do a baseline dyno of what Hulk is after 10,000 miles. You know, I'll, I'll put a clip up to our last dyno run when the car was like bone bone stock. We'll see if it ain't gone. It does have a gel to intake, so it should be a little more powerful. Um, but we're gonna find out because what we're gonna do now is, I'm gonna do a baseline, then we're gonna come back and we're gonna have these cams installed and you're gonna see the sound, the power gain. This car will be tuned by our buddy Rob Shoemaker at Palm Beach Dino. Super excited, Hulk smashed enough stock, I think. They had a great resume, but it's time to step it up. We're super excited we're working with L&M Engines. Link in the description, check them out. We're about to have some fun. Also, while L&M starts up the dyno process, remember guys, we're stepping up. We have new era, really cool hats here. 5.0, of course the 5.0 here. These are really cool. Go to the website, stangmo.com, grab yourself a hat, you get entered to win a 2016 Shelby GT350. And on top of that guys, what you're gonna get is cool hats like this. This is new era guys, this is very nice quality. Very high end. Link in description. Check them out. Maybe we gotta bring Venom here to L&M. Let's see what happens. All right. Without further ado, let's go to the dyno. All right, Chris. Let's do it. So we'll find out what Hulk makes. Hulk has not been dynoed since we first got him, guys. So this is pretty cool. Imagine that chop. the beginning of Hulk's going under extensive gamma radiation right now so just like that we're gonna go different a lot of people start like just the tune we're going cams tune and then we'll start to upgrade as we go with injectors and pulley and E85 and you know we gotta get uh, we gotta cut out the cats things of that nature so we got some things ahead of us so this is gonna be exciting
right guys, so here it is. 678 wheel horsepower on Hulk pre cams at 545 torque. We don't talk about torque on Mustang, we just don't talk about horsepower, but still. <laughs> 678 guys um, you might notice a little bit of bump we had we were like 650 in January we added the JLT colder intake which okay. is good for about 20 or so horsepower right there that's if you're wondering that's why it's a little bit higher but 678 and um, yeah <laughs> oh, it's kind of healthy Six hundred and seventy-eight wheel. The channel light. Yeah, it was six fifty-five wheel. It was six fifty-five wheel in January, but that was before we did the jail to intake and the rest entered delete. You give them that much credit? I, <laughs> yeah, we'll give we'll give some love to JLT on that for that twenty extra horsepower. But so Hulk is six seventy-eight wheel before we do the cams, guys. So that is, we'll do one more test just for the sake of double checking, but uh, 678 wheel horsepower is the Hulk. And uh, when we get the L&M cams in here, we're gonna see what happens next, but we'll do one more. That's pretty healthy though, stock. Almost 700 wheel from a stock car. No, it's pretty good. That's nice. All right. All right. Let's get a little bit to the car. All right, cool. The car in there. All right, guys, so we just got done baselining the Hulk at, what was it, 678? 678. 678 wheel. This is before the L&M comp cams are going in. So next time you see a dyno on the Hulk, Hulk will be cammed with more gamma radiation, I know I'm corny, and a tune from Rob Shoemaker. So we're excited. We got the best team in the business working on Hulk. L&M engines, link in the description. Check them out, because you guys know it never ends. Peace. stay stock for long. He got a little jealous of Mamba. You know, getting on the puzzle. We'll have a little wrap-up conversation. Stay tuned. We'll talk about what the plan plan is. Big shout out LNM engines. Check them out. Link in the description. Paul's gonna smash. So I know what you're thinking, holy cow, you went from just being stock life to now you're camming and tuning the Hulk, the 2020 Shell for GT500. Yes. And the reason we're doing this also is not because it's gonna be really cool and really fast is because I really trust in the craftsmanship and work at LM Engines, along with combining Rob Shoemaker's tune. I think it's a match made in heaven, and um, you know, we're gonna document the process, we're gonna have a good time. Um, you know, for now we're doing cams and a tune. And again, like I said before, there's plenty of places to go and things to do with the, um, you know, um, the E85 and all that kind of stuff, but we'll get there. Um, lower pulley, injectors, um, there's fuel rails, all, it, it never ends really. Um, but we're excited, we're, we're getting into it in a different way um, and we're gonna be the first camped 2020 Shelby GT500 in the world. So I'm excited, I'm honored and Hulk is gonna be the recipient of that power. So can't wait to see, you know, we saw a 678 wheel, um, with Hulk now. Again, the car, we did. We drove about an hour to get there, so it was a little warm. I think it was a little bit more, but we'll see. Uh, that is our baseline, and then when we get back in a few weeks, uh, we'll, we'll document the process, and we'll show you the full goods of showing the install, and then the tune, and uh, the three dyno, so gonna have some fun ahead. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed that, that quick video of the baseline and LM engines, check them out, link in the description. And as you guys know, the Venom GT350 car giveaway is live. Link in the description, stangmode.com. Grab some merch like this or a shirt like this. If you can get it. And if you want cams, go to LM engines. Alright, y'all. Hope you know it never ends. Peace. <laughs>